Stephen Ted Show. Wagle.com. 811 now, Stephen Ted here on KNSS. It is Wednesday. That means time for Wednesdays with Wagle. Dr. Jason Wagle with Kansas Perio and Dental Implants. Good morning, Dr. Wagle. Good morning, Steve. How has your specialty of periodontics changed over the years? You know, the specialty of periodontics was first recognized by the American Dental Association in 1947. At that time, periodontics was focused mainly on cleanings and gum surgery. And back in those days, gum surgery was often uncomfortable. Well, I assume times have changed for the better, right? Yes, it's like night and day. Mm -hmm. With modern techniques, we can keep patients comfortable during these procedures. What about other changes? I would say the scope of of the specialty has greatly expanded. We still focus on saving teeth, but now we also do periodontal plastic surgical procedures that have significant cosmetic benefits. And periodontists are at the forefront of dental implants. I've also heard you mention gum disease as it relates to overall health. Is that correct? Absolutely. There is a growing body of evidence and and scientific studies that indicate the correlation between gum disease and general health. A shorthand way of thinking about it is a healthy mouth is important to having a healthy body. What about the public's perception of periodontists? Well, that's also changed. I think the public is becoming more aware of the importance of having a healthy mouth and the role the periodontist plays in establishing and maintaining oral health. There was a time when virtually all patients who visited the periodontist were referred by a dentist. Those referrals are still very important. And we closely monitor, um, we closely work with um, many excellent dentists in the community. But now patients also routinely find us through our website at kansasperio.com or they're recommended by their medical physician or family and friends. So a referral from a dentist is not required? No, it's not necessary. And if someone needs a dentist, we are happy to help make a recommendation. So what does the future hold for periodontics? Well, the science continues to advance in periodontics, and the future is very bright. We have increasingly sophisticated imaging techniques and the ability to augment soft tissue and bone, we predictably place dental implants that look and function like natural teeth. And more ways than ever, we're able to help people achieve optimal health. All right. Thank you, Dr. Wiggle. And uh, you get outside and enjoy the weather today. Yeah, absolutely. Thank you. Wednesdays with uh, Wiggle, Dr. Jason Wiggle, sponsored by Kansas Perio and Dental Implants. You know, when it's time to get serious about your smile, go to kansasperio.com. And their phone number is 685-2731. Stephen Ted in the morning here on KNSS. Uh...